Preservation for Scythe is one of several groups hoping to see the revitalization of these homes here on Lachlan Avenue, but that fight may be coming to an end. Many of these homes have been around since the early 1920s. Neighbors around here agree they don't want to see these homes torn down. Tan Provenzano and her family have been living on Lachlan Avenue across from Atrian Health Wake Forest Baptist Medical Center for four years. She says she was notified from her landlord that the boarded up homes near her won't be around much longer. She called me a couple of weeks ago and said that um, Wake Forest was going to tear down the houses um, within the next couple of weeks. And she was just informing me because it'll be a lot of noise. According to property records, some of the homes boarded up on Lachlan Avenue are owned by Wake Forest University Baptist Medical Center. Something preservation for site would like to see used as affordable housing options in the future. Historic neighborhoods like this tend to be in the core of the city. What do we need in the core of the city? We need housing in the core of the city because so many of our major employers are right here in the core. This is a great example. Let's see these houses have a second life. Leaders with Preservation for Sight shared their concerns during Wednesday's meeting of the Forsyth County Historic Resources Commission. The organization says most of the homes were built around the 1920s and remain in pretty good condition and hold a lot of history in their design. George Edwards with Preservation for Sight says if the homes are torn down, it would impact the quality of the neighborhood. These houses on Lachlan back up to a natural area, it's still taking all of that quality of housing, quality housing out of there is just not good for the neighborhood. We've reached out to Atrium Health Wake Forest Baptist to see if they have any plans for these homes, but are still waiting to hear back. And Preservation for Sight plan to hold a neighborhood walk to show the history of these homes Monday, June 10th. In Winston-Salem, I'm Kara Peters for WXII 12 News.